this for you. Thank you guys. This is incredible. So I want to get back there. There we go. You can even walk around it. Yeah. How much is this? Yeah. Just tell me how much. Okay. Is that fine? Yeah. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Good. 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 Excited that uh, we were able to donate this equipment to the city school district. Um, the, the business improvement district felt very, very strongly and unanimously actually uh, to donate this to the school because we felt this was cutting edge technology that could be used in the district and actually start to enhance not only the art programs but the science programs and, and many other programs that the city. Uh, gives to the students and we're very, very excited that this is just the beginning and we're hoping to join together between Business Improvement District, other private entities, the city um, government and the school district to come up with funding to expand these programs. Welcome to New Rochelle High School and our wonderful art department wing. And we're here today to talk about our very generous state of the art gift, an AVVR equipment. Uh, it's augmented reality and virtual reality technology. But first and foremost, I want to thank the Business Improvement District for donating this equipment and the system to our school. Um, but Mr. Tarantino, I can tell you how much we appreciate your donation, the support, your presence here today, what it means for our city school district of New Rochelle. On behalf of the Board of Education, President Moselli and Vice President Warhead, I would also like to thank you all for being here for the donation, this incredible opportunity to interact with technology that is cutting edge for students. This idea of bringing uh, the AR, VR equipment to the school district was something that was thought about uh, at the spur of the moment. We had equipment, we weren't sure what to do with it, but we felt that it would be really, really good to sort of include the district, the school district, into what was happening in the city of New Rochelle and the downtown. Uh, it is so important that the public sees our schools, our city, and our private businesses working together to improve the quality of education for our students. And I think that this is a step in that direction. I'm extremely excited. Uh, <clears throat> it's the first step in, in this uh, technology area that really, few years ago, probably two years ago, I, I knew nothing about, and I'm extremely excited that we'll be having the opportunity to see our children in schools have another tool to work with to improve their, their lot in life. I am so excited uh, that we, we have this opportunity in our school. I'm just thrilled to receive the, the ARV, our equipment uh, for our students. Uh, is the perfect technology vehicle to expand our students' imagination and creativity. I am confident that with the help of our skilled and dedicated teachers, our students will impress us with their inspiring creations. I just can't wait to see what greatness comes out of this. Um, it's, it's a very exciting opportunity for all of us. And uh, I thank everyone involved for gifting us and allowing us to have this opportunity. First of all, I'd like to thank the bid for donating this equipment and all who were involved in getting us to this point. Um, this will provide our students with the opportunity and access to this cutting edge technology where they can experience the act of creating art through the use of virtual reality as a new medium. It will engage students in an interactive learning experience and give them exposure to immersive learning and improved technological literacy. And we could not have gotten this far without 
our students who participated, the support from their parents, and our school district. I'm somewhat familiar with it. I'm going to get to it. We heard about art, but I'm thinking all the other realms of curriculum and subjects and subject matter. So instantly, world languages popped into my head. Imagine taking a trip to Barcelona, true immersion. Um, that's how I learned the language. That's how many of us learned the language. Now they can do it in each of these classrooms. Social studies, of course, instead of talking and reading about what happened at uh, X, Y, Z, Elemental P, A, D, and B, C, let's take a trip to the Colosseum. So I'm really excited about exploring that. But I also know that our students are familiar with this technology. First time I've ever been exposed to it was in the colleague's house and their teenage son said, here, try this on, and here I am boxing against Rocky Balboa. So right then and then I thought, oh my God, what if we brought this into the school? So I'm happy that we have it here. And the fact that our students have a one step up on us, that's great because we are preparing students for a field and positions and careers that- Hey, you're not gonna hit. No, it's the, the sensors won't pick it up. Okay, got it. All right. I mean, I can get a little bit- closer, That's that's perfect, that, that works, that works. It just, just it's tries. Up. Okay, so I'm just rolling on this. Is that, is that okay? So camera rolls. Yeah. If you are too.